This home at 2030 West Illinois Street was built in 1904 for Dr. John W. Lorenz. His family lived in an apartment above the drugstore that he ran and owned on Franklin Street. Lorenz and his family moved into this newly constructed home, but their stay was short-lived. A flu epidemic surfaced that forced Dr. Lorenz to run back and forth between his home and store. This prompted Lorenz to move his family back to the apartment above the store, and this house was soon bought by grocer George C. Fisher for $6,000. The Fisher family would stay in this home for more than two decades. This well-appointed two-story house is in the free classic style and incorporates features from many different styles of architecture. The facade of the home is dominated by a large octagonal two-and-a-half-story tower. The tower is covered by a steep pointed roof, while the rest of the house has a multifaceted hip and gable roof. The house incorporates a classical style porch supported by four ionic columns. The porch features a wooden banister. The roof of the porch is lined with a short decorative railing giving the appearance of a balcony. The first floor facade has two rectangular double hung windows on the porch separated by a front door topped with a transom. On the second floor above the porch, there is a large rectangular double hung window in between two small decorative windows. This gives the appearance of a door onto the faux balcony. The front protruding gable features cornice returns. The gable is covered with fish scaled shingles surrounding a palladium window. The brick chimney on the west side of the house is ornamented with beautiful brickwork. The Lorenz Fisher home stands out as one of the most unique architectural gems in the historic Franklin Street District.